Hello everyone, it's Jack from Visual Effects Hut and today we'll be showing you how to do like a black pro mist filter or like diffusion on a lens. So rather than filming it in real life, add it on in post and then you've got more options I guess. It's obviously not quite the same but if you want that kind of effect but you don't have the filter or it wasn't used on the day then this is, the, this is how to do it. So there's a few places where you can buy the uh, mist style filters. Um, so, so we sell some too and ours are quite fairly priced. So what you do is just go to our store and then look some presets and you'll see the VH mist diffusion filters for Adobe Premiere. At the moment it's just for Premiere. Um, if you are a subscriber, because um, you do a lot of visual effects and 3D work as well, you can get it from the asset library too. If you're already subscribed then you don't need to pay any more you can just get it today so without further ado let's jump in so we've got this lovely shot it already looks quite hazy but um, we can definitely boost this up more once you've installed the presets all you need to do is go to presets and visual effects effect diffusion and then you'll have different amounts of diffusion so that one eighth being the least and half being the most if you use the match exposure it should keep all the grading that you've done it might make it a slight bit brighter but um, generally it'll keep it very close to what you've done and then still give you that effect if you put this on it will brighten it up a bit but we can show you that now so what we do is we need to duplicate a clip but you can hold alt and drag up and it'll duplicate that clip above itself and then it is literally as simple as dragging on let's go for the half match exposure onto the top clip and then we get that nice dreamy creamy look so if we just go undo and we zoom in just so you can see especially in the highlight areas we'll drop it on again nice look so um show you what the without the match exposure so this is with match exposure and then this is without so it's a lot brighter it's quite more it's a more severe effect but it kind of affects the grade as well so that's why we've done both but there's a lot of options to play with and at eight being the least so let's just put on another shot dreamy so hopefully you found this insightful um, if you go to the description you can see the link where to get it from but there are a few places where to get these sort of fills from but they all work generally the same so um, have fun and I'll catch you on the next one <laughs>